Blessed good morning to you, my beloved. Blessings indeed to you. I don't know who you are that click on this video, but I hope all is well. And if everything is not fine, just take life one day at a time, step by step. And today, daily mood topic is they are nosy slash busy body. Beloved, there are some people in your life who is such a nosy person, so inquisitive, so fixed on you, like them focus just depend on you. So, right? Yeah. Right, you have some people at your workplace, they're just nosy, all up in your business, one more walk one. Right, guys, right, so they might do research by you. Right, yeah, like a satellite. Right, yeah, that moving left, right, and center. Right, yes, guys, they're not even, you know, focusing on their own life, they're focusing on your life, beloved. Yes, there's some people, right, in your community, whether at your workplace, Right, with a business acquaintance, just all up in your business, just fix by you. So, right, they even know more about yourself than you know about yourself. Right, yes, right. So, you have some people out there, guys, they're just nosy, right? Gossipers, idlers, and have nothing else to do. Right, then it's like they just fix on your life, they not even have no care if you see what going on in their own life. To see how they can improve in their own life, beloved. To see how they can make changes in their own self, right? So they just focus on you, right? Yeah, like a fax machine, right? Yes, guys, they just and for them business are spoil like any ten day cabbage water. This is how people are today: idlers, busybody, nosy people, inquisitive people. Them not understand say, you know, the enemy using them like the minions that they are right to do homework right yeah because i come like a homework they're doing beloved because they're so fixed on you so focused on you they're not seeing what is going on in their life they're not seeing what they're missing they're not seeing that the wind right yeah just blowing them life left right and center they don't see that their life is passing by like the wind beloved because they're so fixed on you focus on you they're missing out so much in their life so if you're that man or that woman watching me today and you're that busybody all up in a people business mind your business beloved focus on your own life see how you can improve in your life see how you can improve in your own business see how you can improve in your own relationship see how you can improve in oneself beloved and stop letting the wind pass you by, beloved. Stop allowing the enemy to use you like a puppet, beloved. To do homework about others, beloved. Right? Yeah, don't be that idler no more. Make that change today in the mighty name of Jesus. Change the, your thinking pattern. Change your mindset, beloved. Change your views of how you view others. Beloved, Sheer love. Sheer love. It's time for you to change, you know, change up your, 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 your caliber. And sheer love. What about love? What about love, beloved? Your heart is so cold while you just fix on somebody of life. Wanting to know what's going on with another person. Focus on oneself, beloved. It's time you focus on oneself, beloved. And if you're that person, people, you know, just nosy all up in your business, so busy body doing research on you, right? Yes, and you know, right? Just trust God with your journey. Focus on God and fear them not, beloved, right? Yes, have no fear at all, beloved, right? Because some people are very idlers in this time, beloved, right? Yeah, busy body, all up in people's business. Not seeing what is happening in their own business, beloved. Right? Those are toxic people, beloved. Right? Yeah. They're not evolved all now. They're not evolved, beloved. Right? So they're just all up in your business. All right, my beloved? What I mean by that? Well, according to 1 Timothy 5 verse 13, it says, And with all they learn to be idle, wandering about from house to house, and not only idle, but toddlers also and busybodies speaking things which they are not to. 
right? Yes, yeah, so you have some people out there, beloved. They all up in a people business, minding other people business, but not, you know, minding their own business, right? Not showing love, right? Yeah, they're not showing love. So when you're a per person, you can't be an idler, being a gossiper, a busybody, then you're not showing any love at all, beloved, right? It's time for you to show love to others, my beloved. So if you're the person, you know, and you are a busybody, you know, you wander to house to house, right? You know, trying to, you know, seek information about somebody, gossip about somebody, wanting to, to know the bad things about others, right? It's time you, you know, rearrange that mindset, beloved, you know, and share some love, share love, man. What happened to the love? Where the love have gone, my beloved? Right? Yes, you're speaking things that which you are not to. Right? You're gossiping about people which you are not to. Right? And God is reminding us in 1 Timothy 5 verse 13. Right? Yes, but toddlers also and busybody speaking things which they are to not. Right? Yes, so beloved, stop doing that. Speak love. Share love. Stop being a gossiper, right? If you're going to be a gossiper, be a good gossiper then, right? Yes, man, all right? Yes, man, consider other people, right? Not only yourself, but consider other people, beloved, and just share love, right? Yes, man, demonstrate love, beloved. In everything that you do, demonstrate love, right? Extend love towards people instead of gossiping about people, slandering others, lie about others speaking things which are not to right beloved yes man read this wonderful scriptures of uh, first corinthians 5 verse 13 meditate on the scripture and apply it in your daily life i pray have a wonderful and a blessed monday one love thank you